Have you ever had a dream that felt so real you could have sworn it happened? I myself have woken up countless times swearing I had won the lottery. This commentary is brought to you by the new NBC show Awake, a show about a guy torn between his dream world and real world, premiering March 1st on NBC at 10 p.m. 9 central. Check out the teaser trailer and full pilot here on YouTube by just clicking the annotation where you can also subscribe to NBC's channel for exclusive content and updates. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Lefty from 643 Productions coming at you here with a Modern Warfare 3 Team Deathmatch gameplay commentary. Here I am in the map Resistance using the P90 with a suppressor. This gameplay is part of the Quack Clan Revival Tour coming to a Team Deathmatch server near you. Now, the FMG9s have been the topic of much discussion throughout the entire lifetime of Modern Warfare 3, what short lifetime it has had thus far in the gaming community. But the FMG9s, again, have been a, a topic of hot discussion or a hot topic of discussion pretty much throughout that entire time. First, uh, at the beginning of the game, everybody was saying, oh my gosh, these guns are so amazing, they're, they're so much fun, and then uh, and then shortly thereafter, a lot of people were saying, these guns are so incredibly overpowered, something's got to be done to them. There was a slight nerf by Infinity Ward, and then everybody was still saying after that nerf, they were saying, they're, they're, what? There was a nerf? I didn't know about it, huh? What? What nerf? I'm still getting dominated by these things, and, and I'm still dominating with them. And uh, in Activision, uh, or Infinity Ward, that is, didn't really do much. And then there was a, a, a title update that accidentally buffed the FMG9s by proxy, and everybody went incredibly insane after that. And then uh, finally, uh, Robert Bowling from Infinity Ward, the creative strategist at Infinity Ward, got a little uppity at, at, at all the criticism he was getting for his team's ineptitudes, and, uh, and said, fine, thanks, Internet. I'm going to change the FMG9s again. And uh, nothing really happened. Again, they were brought back to the level, really, where everybody was saying, no, something actually needs to be done to these things. The FMG9s offer incredible firepower with incredible accuracy. It's as if the the, uh, the Akimbo FMG9s, here it is, it's, it's, it's as if you doubled the fire rate of a single FMG9 and doubled the magazine size. That's what running a weapon akimbo is, and with the FMG9 with its high fire rate and relatively high damage, I mean, this, this thing is outclassing most SMGs in terms of damage, and it's a machine pistol, it, it, it still does an incredible amount of damage, and, and it still is in, uh, able to dominate uh, pretty much absolutely on the battlefield. And so we have this tweet from Robert Bowling here on the 22nd of February. The, the first tweet is from Cod Ideas at 402. He says, Quote, Akimbo FMG9s are still way too strong at 402, hashtag MW3. Robert Bowling's response at Cod Ideas, quote, I agree, and they'll be receiving a nerf in a few days. Again, that was on December 22nd of 2012, so we are have to be on the lookout again in the next few days for a nerf to the FMG9s again. Again, they're going to get nerfed, and I'm I'm, I'm just the messenger. Don't shoot me. You know, I'm, I, I break it down for you guys, and I try not to try not to be biased, but you know, and I, I do agree with this. I have to say, I have to say, I do agree with this, uh, the, the continued nerf of the FMG nines. I think this should have been done a long time ago. I think from the very beginning, there should have been a substantive nerf to the FMG nines in modern warfare three, but they, they've done this nerf piecemeal. It's been little bit, little bit, little bit. Okay. We're going to undo everything because we're idiots. And then we're going to undo a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. So I don't know what the FMG nine nerf is going to be in terms of specifics in the in the coming days so let me know what you guys think in the comments below how would you nerf the fmg9 let's say you are an uh, infinity ward creative strategist robert bowling and you've got a gun to your head i don't care if you like the fmg9s how would you nerf them would you make the hip fire spread incredibly large or would you reduce the the rpm or the damage rpm and damage let me know in the comments below but anyway guys that's my time i got to get out of here thank you for joining i hope you enjoyed be sure to drop a like on this video if you did enjoy I am out.